So the iPhone 15 Pro has just been announced, so let's go and see how this specific iPhone holds up against the iPhone 12 Pro and see which specific one is the better one for you. Now, first of all, with, you know the iPhone 15 Pro is definitely going to be the better iPhone in basically every single way. It's going to be having better build quality this time around, so you're actually going to be getting that titanium build quality on the iPhone 15 Pro, which is honestly a very, very cool thing. So it's going to be better built from that standpoint, which is really awesome. We're also going to be getting this new customizable action button on the iPhone 15 Pro. So this is a pretty big deal because it's going to be just overall the better performing you know, build quality, which you're also going to be getting newer buttons on the iPhone 15 Pro as well, which is honestly very cool. That's something that once again, like a lot of people probably haven't had yet. So it's really cool that we have a, an actual you know, customizable button on our Pro model iPhones that the Apple Watch already kind of had. Now, I'm sure the 12 Pro is still going to be holding up well in terms of the body, but with the 15 Pro, you're also going to be getting that new A17 Pro chip inside. This is the first time we've seen a Pro chip on an iPhone. So I'm really, really happy that Apple actually ended up bringing this type of you know feature set today, which is really awesome. On top of that, this is also the lightest Pro model iPhones Apple has ever made. So they're lighter and they're th they have th the thinnest borders on any of the iPhone you know, Pro models they made too. So that's another really cool thing that they ended up having. Also, the camera quality on these iPhones are going to be improved coming from the iPhone 12 Pro. But one of the biggest changes they've done from what I can see is they have now brought USB-C on the iPhones. So before with the iPhone 15, you know, the 14 or whatever, the iPhone 14s and before, they didn't have USB-C. These new iPhones actually have it now, which is very, very cool. So once again, that is a very awesome thing that Apple actually ended up doing. And I'm, once again, very much looking forward to it from that specific standpoint. So overall, the iPhone 15 Pro is going to definitely be and just one of the better iPhones Apple has ever made. I'm very, very much looking forward to it. I can't wait for it to come out. But that's basically how it's been holding up for the last couple of, you know, for basically, you know, a quick comparison of it. <laughs> if you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.